Welcome, we are Thornton Media. We can teach you how to program popular Nintendo DSIs to teach your language. With our Language Pal software, you can create flashcards, multiple choice quizzes, image quizzes, as well as many other features. We got feedback from some of our recent native clients who have programmed DSI units in their language. We're using it is because the, it generated so much interest among the young people. As soon as we mention DS, it's going to be for the DSI, you know, the people are excited about it and, and, and ready for us, ready, ready for it to happen. So, and, and we've had a lot of problems, a lack of interest or a lack of motivation with actually attending the language classes. And this has helped spark uh, a new interest and some motivation among the young people for it. So we appreciate that. I think the advantage of the DSI would be that it's all new technology. I mean, children watch TV more than they play outside. So this way, with the DSI, they can incorporate their language while taking it home and still continue their learning throughout the day. If you can teach your children through this uh, what it, language pal, if you can teach your children with this at school, then you, know, you can incorporate to the parents because a lot of the culture is being lost so they can take this home and make it, you know, as a family they can learn. You know, some parents don't even know the language, so it's, it's a benefit for all. Oh, it is brilliant. It's just, un I, yeah, it's just so inspiring. Um, we've always had language here, like in our schools, uh, and we've had such a hard time finding ways to inspire kids because there is no written um, word. It's all passed on by legend. Our elders are losing them. A lot of that information is going with them. And just that this is like a permanent document, and it's something that we'll always be able to use, always be able to update. It's exciting. Um, the kids are interested right at the start. Well, we're, we're impressed with the commitment that, that people have and, and the effort that they put into to making it work, to making it interesting, because it's one thing to have a game, but it's, it's something else to have something in that game that is really going to interest the students at the same time reach the goal that everybody has, which is to learn the language. It's a big difference. Everybody likes to go learn through technology. They don't want to sit every time on the paper pencil. They like to, they need change. And this is a very good change. I think it's because it's something they're familiar with already. It's something they associate with, with having fun. It's something that they think is kind of fun and cool. And it's something they can manipulate really well. I think sometimes when you put, uh, not all kids, but sometimes if you put books or put a kid in front of a computer, they somehow, oh, it's school, it's work. It's work and it's not fun. And I think with Nintendo, it's, it's all going to be fun and it's going to be kind of, it's going to be a game-like format. I'm not only a student here at Jijunhei Ungwawana, I'm also a volunteer teacher as well. And my current intended use is to use it to, uh, as a foundation builder for introductory classes of people with basically no knowledge of the Mohawk language. And from there we, we plan on branching it out as well into a intermediate and an advanced level because uh, what we found with the program is that it's limitless, it's only limited by your imagination, by what you can use it for. The software was uh, really intuitive. It was very um, easy to use because there's not a lot of steps. I would recommend the product to anyone who wants to preserve their language. Kids these days are really more uh, multimedia focused and to put a DSI in their hands to help learn the language. If, if that's what they need, then that's what we need to do. I think it's one of the best systems that I've come across because it not only gives you an idea of the, uh, the, the, the language itself and the sound system, the writing system, you can also use it to make it more picturesque and more understanding. You know, we, we participate in as much technology type of resources as we can to help us with our uh, language efforts. And we've researched a lot of different language software companies and a lot of different, we look them up on the web and then we contact them and then we see what, and most of the problems that we encounter have to do with um, ownership. You know, they eventually, they own the product. We do a lot of the work and they own the product. I believe you're the only ones that we've contacted that have, that have 
that have been legitimate with actually saying, you know, it's yours. I've been working with uh, Thornton Media for about uh, four years now. I would like to uh, uh, congratulate and thank uh, uh, Thornton Media for doing such a wonderful work promoting the language using the devices, uh, the techn technological devices that they're using at the moment. And I think hope we can continue uh, uh, reach to other native communities that haven't been exposed to this type of uh, uh, new invention. You are wonderfully accommodating, you answer the client's needs, and I appreciate your sensitivity to some of the concerns uh, that certain tribes might have about um, ac uh, ownership of the language, and uh, you've just been wonderful. Uh, I, I couldn't praise you highly enough. Well, when I first heard of the DSI training, I was actually impressed, amazed actually, that they found a technology to collaborate the language with the new system that the children are all using in the communities as young as three years old. So as a kindergarten teacher I found that this would be interesting for me. So when I came and I finished the training I loved it. I think it's an amazing tool to use to teach the children the language for today. And I'm glad like uh, you guys are not OG Cree and you still made this program and this is amazing. The way you taught us, uh, you made it easier for us, like we were able to catch on. We thought it was going to be, I thought it was going to be really, really difficult. Mm -hmm. But I caught on, I can't yeah. believe it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it wasn't, wasn't that bad. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I think we can do it. It was very uh, interesting, very exciting, and uh, I know the involvement of the elders was great. They were really happy, they thanked us. But I wish we had more time and we, I wish we would have been prepared more mm -hmm. because uh, I, uh, this morning I had to go and see the elders and kind of rushed. So uh, I wish we had more time. But yeah. We did well. We did a lot of work. I think we did well. I wish you could stay longer. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm yes. scared for you guys. I wish you could do, then. do this to every language in, the, in the Canada, I guess. Yeah. It's a good way to save our language. And we're going to be the first in the way <laughs> yeah. to have it. So. <laughs> yeah, I was just yeah. really proud. Yeah.